Hi, Gary. So, um, could you tell us what was different about the way that you approached the Revenue Assurance Survey this year? Hi, Sarah. Uh, I think that the important thing in the Revenue Assurance Survey this year is that it's based on questions asked by operators. So, first we ask operators, what are the questions that you have in mind regarding revenue assurance for which you cannot add, find answers in other surveys? Mm -hmm. So that was the starting point. And really this enabled a lot of operators to be really active in creating this survey mm -hmm. and then in promoting this survey for, to their colleagues because they wanted to see the answers. This led the survey to have a record number of 122 participants, I think representing over 100 companies, which is amazing because it permits you to really understand the results yeah. in different dimensions, size of operators, different regions, type of services, etc. So having such a big number of answers really gave us a lot of insights. And um, what were some of the sort of headline results that stood out to you? Well, there are several interesting things in the results. First, if we look, one of the questions asked to who is revenue insurance reporting, in what part of the organization is revenue insurance. When revenue insurance started around 10 years ago, well, it didn't start there, but it started to get momentum there. So in many places you see revenue insurance under IT, under networks. Mm -hmm. In this survey, 100 different companies, nobody was under IT, nobody was under a network. You see a large majority under the CFO organization. So this is, if you look from a historical point of view, a, large, a really big change. Then we had many questions in which we correlated the maturity level of the operator versus his activities in different way, in different dimensions. So being proactive versus being reactive coverage to new services, coverage to new technologies. So all these gives very interesting results and really permit you to gain more insights about yourself. Okay, I am this kind of operator, mm -hmm. this is my maturity, how I, can comp I, how I compare with other peers, what are my aspirations and how these other more mature operators are operating, what are activities they are doing in revenue shows. So a lot of material, not just to read, but to take action items upon them. Okay, and so any revenue assurance professionals out there, how would you urge them to use the results, or what, what should they do practically? And we are taking a different approach in this survey that in most of the surveys in the industry, we are also presenting the raw results, so each one can see, and see the results and give its own interpretation but we will also present interpretations of experts. So what experts are taking from this survey, and there will be recommendations, okay, now you can took this kind of action items based on the results of this survey. So really, the idea is not just to have reading material, mm -hmm. but really something that can lead you to actions. Excellent, looking forward to reading it, and thank you. Thank you very much.